What's going on guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the multiplayer lobby for Call of Duty World War II. Now, I'm going to have the image on screen for you guys right now, and you're going to notice here that it's absolutely beautiful. You're going to see every single soldier that's going to be in your lobby, and uh, obviously the division that they're a part of, and I just think it looks absolutely beautiful. But uh, obviously guys, this is not going to be the final build of the lobby. There are some stuff missing, for example, like the game playlist. I think at E3, the only three game modes that you can play was TDM, Domination, and War. There's no kill confirm there's no ctf there's no free for all there's no standard game modes that are in every single call of duty game so i do think that this lobby is not going to look exactly like this but there are going to be some aspects to it for example all the soldiers sitting down at the beach you know waiting to uh do the thing so i do think that's pretty cool uh but yeah this is not going to be the final build of this game also there is no option to go to the headquarters so like i said this is not going to be the same build of the lobby but it is pretty much going to have the same layout so that is very very cool and uh, for the second part of the video guys I want to talk about character customization because that is a pretty touchy subject for our Call of Duty community uh, a lot of people don't like character customization at all and uh, they also don't like supply drops in general I for one don't like weapon variants in supply drops I think supply drops are you know not that bad of a thing but if there's weapons that are simply locked to supply drops only I'm not a fan of that and uh, so yeah I really do hope that World War 2 doesn't have that kind of system I do kind of wish that they would have a salvage system or like a craft system like an infinite warfare or MWR that would be pretty cool if they are gonna have weapon variants or anything in the game like that I really hope that we can craft anything and everything in the game but uh, there is gonna be character customization in the game because there was a divisions pack that came out uh, earlier this week so if you pre-order World War 2 then you can pretty much get all this gear set for every single division in the game you're gonna see it on screen right now so there is gonna be character customization in this game in case you guys were wondering about that I for one was actually kind of curious to know why Sledgehammer didn't say anything about supply drops or weapon variants or character customization in this game during the reveal at E3. It is pretty odd, but I guess they are saving that for a later week because, again, it is a very, very touchy subject for the Call of Duty community. But I want you guys to tell me your thoughts about the multiplayer lobby and the supply drops in general down in the comment section below. Do you guys like it? Do you guys hate it? And what are your, what are your thoughts? Also, drop a like if you guys did enjoy. Thanks so much for watching. I'm a Vert. Have a great rest of the day. Till next time, I'll catch you guys later.